In this video, we're going to take a look at the minor pentatonic scale. Uh, this particular shape has probably been played in 80-90% of rock, metal, classic rock, pop tunes that you hear on the radio um, for years. So we're going to break this down. Something to keep in mind. We're going to look at one shape of that scale right now, but in total there are five different shapes that you can play using the same notes. And we're going to go through each one in a series of videos breaking down each position and, and how to play that shape. Nothing more than that. We will later start tying in the theory piece of it, but I want you to start going over just the shapes, how to play them, what fingers to use, at least in my opinion, that work for me. And then we'll, in, in a later video, we'll tie all of it together where you see it actually each position, I should say each shape will start to fit together like dovetail joints, like a jigsaw puzzle across the, the fretboard where you'll be able to go from one end to the other really just playing five notes okay so let's take a look at the first position right now probably the most iconic one that most people would know when they first start playing the guitar for the minor pentatonic scale um, we can play this anywhere i choose to start this on the fifth string uh, on the with the root on the sixth i should say the fifth fret with the root on the sixth string here. Starting there puts everything into the key of A minor. And for me, I just prefer to do that because it gives me some room to work here for some other, other shapes, as well as moving down the entire fretboard. And if you watch the further videos to come out, you'll understand how this starts to, how to work together. So let's just take a look at the first position for A minor. Keep in mind for all of these scales or these, these positions, again, I, I, I keep correcting myself, it's two notes per string and we move on. Simple as that, okay? So we'll start on this one. We're gonna be on the sixth string with the root on the fifth fret. So this is where we're gonna begin, right here. So it'll be, and we're not gonna worry about the names of the notes. That'll come later. Again, I want you to just get in the habit of just playing the scale, all right? And what frets to start on. So we're gonna go string by string, okay? Sixth string, five, eight. Fifth string, five, seven. Fifth string, uh, excuse me, fourth string, five, seven. Third string, five, seven. Second string, five, eight. And then the final string, the first string, five, eight. Now keep in mind, if we're gonna be keeping it within the key, the, 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 the scale actually ends right here. We just begin repeating it. So you actually have within this shape we just did two octaves of the same scale. Which is one shape. I should say one octave, and then the octave itself, the other A is right here, and we continue. It ends there, also begins there, and we continue on. Now we've run out of strings, obviously, but you'll see how moving it up and down the fretboard gives us more real estate to work with. So again, we're gonna go to, uh, excuse me, on, on the sixth string, five, eight, five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, Five, eight. And again, I'm using my index finger. It's basically one, one finger per fret. So I go index pinky, index ring, index ring, index ring, index pinky, index pinky. And again, that's an A minor chord, and you can kind of hear how it ties it all together. Okay, because that chord is within those notes we just played. But again, this is the first of five shapes we can work with for the A minor pentatonic scale. 